welcome to another Shelly Savings video. Well, it's time for another Savings or Not video, and today we are doing coffee. Yes, it's a bit overcast today, a bit cold, perfect weather for a coffee. Now, I decided we'd look at a couple of different methods of making your own coffee versus buying your coffee each day on your way to work. Now, I looked at the cost of buying a coffee each day on your way to work, so working out that you work five days a week, 48 weeks a year, so four weeks off if you're lucky, uh, you're probably going to be looking at spending, well, if you're paying for all the coffees, 240 coffees a year, uh, average price $4.80 a coffee, when I went online and had a look, you're looking at $1,152 a year in coffee. Now, a lot of places, though, do have reward cards. When you buy 10 coffees, you get a coffee free. Uh, so I did decide, let's work on the reward cards. Let's work on the cheapest you could probably get your coffee for the year. And that came to $1,051.20 for the year. So we now have a base cost on how much our coffee costs each morning on the way to the office or to work, wherever it is. Now, straight away, you know you're going to save money if you have a coffee machine like this. Now, there's two different types of coffee machines, and I decided to do both. You've got your standard coffee machine, which you can buy nowadays with a grinder attached. Um, I actually have a big grinder as well as one of these. And you're looking at the average cost of around $599 for a machine like this. Some are dearer, some are cheaper, depending on what extras you want to get. Uh, so I worked out $699. You're going to get at least two years out of this. So my next lot of uh, costings are actually going to be over two years. The other thing is, how much will a coffee cost you? Well, it's going to cost you a lot cheaper. You're going to be looking at around 35 cents per each coffee with an extra 20 cents for your milk. So you're looking at 55 cents per cup of coffee using your machine. So for the coffee costs over two years, you're looking at $528 for the coffee. Include your machine at $699, and this is going to cost you $1,227 over two years for coffee. That means you're going to save around $875.40 making your own coffee before you go to work each morning. However, I'm going to be honest, I have this machine, I don't think it's been turned on in about a year. Uh, my husband does love making coffee, but in the morning the whole reason you're buying coffee on the way to work is because you want someone else to do it because it's quicker or you don't have time, you want to rush out the door and you don't want to be sitting there having to froth your milk is probably the biggest thing. Uh, so I decided, well, what happens if you bought a machine that was fully automatic? You can get some new machines nowadays where you literally put the cup underneath, press play, walk away, come back and you've got your cappuccino with your frothy top and everything done for you. Those machines will cost you a lot more. I did buy one for around $1,499. Coffee will still cost the same at $528 over two years. So you're looking at your investment would be $2,027. And guess what? You'll actually still save money if you buy that fancy machine and do that coffee every day. Not as much, only about $75.40 over two years by buying a full automated machine. However, the chances are that machine will go longer than two years, so you'll actually save more as you go on. But that's just my honest opinion. These are great, but you'll probably find after two months you're going to stop using it. You don't want to froth up the milk every morning. You're trying to rush out the door, and all you want to do is put a cup underneath and press play or ask someone to get you a coffee on your app and pick it up as you go into the office. So that came to the next choice. You can get these pod machines. Now, some pod machines don't have this. This particular pod machine actually has a milk frother. Uh, I got lucky with this pod machine. Um, I'll have to do a video one day on op shopping. I was in an op shop and here was this pod machine for $10. Instructions never used with the plastic still on it. Now, this machine will actually cost you Around $399, I have seen them down to $349, but I'm going to stick with the $399 price. So I decided, well, you know, pods cost more, but can we still save money for this guy? And he is exactly what you're after, fully automated. So if you bought, I had a look at the cost. Now your pods are going to average anywhere from $0.37 cents a pod, anywhere up to $0.80 cents a pod. I decided to do my savings challenge, let's say you're buying 80 cent pods, so in theory you could save more, but let's go with that. Your milk, after I measured it up, is costing you 15 cents for your milk, so it's a little cheaper in milk because you're not going to use as much because it's automated. Uh, 
So if we go with 80 cent pods, again, we're using 240 a year, so 480 over two years, you're going to look at your pods costing you $456, uh, including milk in that. Machine, 399 so your two-year investment on a pod machine is $855. So over two years, you're actually going to save $1,247.40 by having a pod machine and literally just have your coffee made for you. Now, the good thing is, nowadays, we all have keep cups. So if you use your little keep cup, no one even knows that you brought a coffee from home into the office. So there's no more of that social oh she made her coffee now I decided though how many people buy two coffees a day now you're not going to buy the automated full machine for a hundred or one thousand four hundred ninety nine dollars and like I said this guy is a bit of a novelty you're probably not going to buy an extra one of these for the workplace so you're probably going to buy a coffee throughout the day as well as the coffee now you'll still save on your coffee but let's say you want to save even maximum money you could actually buy two of these machines at $399. So it will cost you $798 for two machines. You can have one at home and one at work. Your pods will cost $912 because now you're buying two lots of pods for your two coffees a day. Well, when you take the price of two coffees a day, that's around $4,204.80 over two years on coffee. Uh, if you were to buy two pod machines and make your own coffee, one in the office and one at home, you're actually going to save $2,494.80 over two years for two cups of coffee by having a machine. That equates to over $1,200 a year or $25 a week over 48 weeks a year that you're at work. So looking at all this, your actual best savings is the pod machine. I think there are a nice and easy and they actually fill that gap of you can put your cup under it and walk away however I have had some people go but what about the waste you've got these capsules what do I do with them I don't want to chuck them in the bin we're all about war and waste nowadays well most of these capsules are actually aluminium and there is a company online which is run through planet art called TerraCycle they have free postage put them all into a bag get a postage wrap send them off and they actually recycle all these the uh, coffee grinds inside will actually go off the compost and the aluminium pods will become aluminium pods again. So you can actually feel free using your pod machine knowing that you're not going to have the waste. So when it comes down to it, the reason you chose this machine was for less waste, you're not going to get the same waste anyway with this guy. So as you can see, you can actually save quite a bit of money making your own coffee at home, put it into your own cup, take it along, drink it in the car, drink it in the workplace, and if you want to save even more money, if you're a two-a-day coffee drinker, buy an extra machine for the workplace. You might even find that group of you could pitch in, buy one for the workplace and all use that coffee machine. Again, if they last longer than two years, you'll save even more money. So as you can see, is it a savings or not? Yes! Coffee pods and coffee machines will save you on your daily coffee on the way to work. So why not pick one up today? They're nice and simple to use. And it's just a matter of pressing a button. Oh, helps if I put the coffee cup under. And there you go, you've got your nice easy coffee coming out while you make your toast. And there you have it, coffee without the hard work and lots of savings for you. Thank you for watching another Shelly Savings video. Uh, why not click on the bell below so you can get a notification when I make new videos. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more ideas, recipes and ways to save money. It's time to go and have a cup of coffee.